cookbook author and celebrity chef, and she is here to tell us about her new book, Everyday Grand, Soulful Recipes for Celebrating Life's Big and Small Moments. Please welcome Chef Jocelyn Delk Adams. <laughs> chef Jocelyn! Okay, it smells so good. You gotta tell Woo! us about your new book. Mm. Mm, you're, like, you're like just taking it all in, Girl, aren't you? Yes. My new book, Everyday Grand, is all about amazing recipes, over 80 new ones, but it's about how you can celebrate, not just in the kitchen, but in life in general. Oh, that sounds so right? good. And we, yes. And we want to bring back intention in our lives, finding joy, finding gratitude, ways that we can just really appreciate everything in life. Okay, and we're going to do it through food. We sure are, because we are making some oxtails and cornmeal dumplings. Oxtails and cornmeal dumplings. Yes. Oh, my gosh. Well, wait, before we start, I want you to finish telling me. We're going to yes. say hi to our guests at our tasting yes. table. Uh, Marco G. We got... <laughs> and we have Melissa. They're going to be eating along with us today. So we're going to get started. So we got the oxtails and the... And the um, Ooh, corn yeah. yeah, so we've got Dumplings. the oxtails here. So I've started with some veggies that we're going to sweat down, like some onions. I've even got some Girl, bacon in here. sweated vegetables. Sweated Ooh, vegetables, girl, aren't yeah. they the best? when they perspire, yes. uh -huh. yeah, get in there. So we're gonna add back in some of our ingredients. So we're gonna actually let this go for a little bit and then we're gonna add some flour to thicken. Okay. We got a bunch of spice, y'all, because I believe in flavor. Everyday Grand is about flavor. flavor. Oh, are y'all enjoying I that flavor? So oh, yes. You liking it, Marco? All right. Okay. <laughs> Marco, tell him to get that book, okay? Okay. <laughs> So Ooh. we're gonna add in some tomato paste. This is really gonna also act as a thickener. And then yes. I have so many liquids here. I even have what something is all like the liquid? Dr. Pepper. The soda Dr. Pepper? The soda oh Dr. Gosh, Pepper. Really? Yes, it's actually one of my little tricks. That gives like a little tang? It gives it a little tang. Okay. I've got some wine. You can have a little drink while you're cooking this too. Oh my so God. you can do that too. Oh, and look then I've at got this. some beef stock and then also some other stuff like some Worcestershire. And this is all uh, like yes. a little roux, like the flavor. Yeah, you're going to get all of that in and then we're going to put all of our our um, oxtails right back into this, and then Ooh. we're gonna let them go for a really long period, like two and a half hours, but the best things in life take a little time. That's right. right. So you put the oxtails in here. Yes, Ooh. and then we're gonna close that down once you get them all in there. Oh my goodness, you Look smell. at that, it looks yeah. so good. Look at this, look at this. All the spices. Come, come smell this, come smell I this. Mm. Oh my it God! It smells like comfort. It, it smells does. like so, like just someone's kitchen. Like I feel peace. Mama. Look. Mm. Oh <laughs> my God! Do you guys feel comfort? Is you? Yes. Eating? What do you guys oh. think, you guys? Everything oh, so Irie. Good. Irie. Yes. Oh. This oh is my a God. win. This is a win. So, so we're gonna like Yeah, so this is where we add in the cornmeal dumplings. And this is like the part where I was like, okay, let's do something a little different. You wanna scoop some in, Sherry? So you got the cornmeal dumplings yeah. in and I wanna watch you because I like my piece over here. So I'm gonna watch you. <laughs> so and you I'm put this gonna, in. Yeah, just gonna scoop this in. And it's almost like cornbread and a dumpling had a baby. And you let this sit. Yeah. Now why are you doing this? What's the next recipe? Oh that we're my going goodness. Start? Yes, absolutely. So the next recipe is I've got right an alote fry. Fried corn pudding. A lote fried corn yes. pudding. I'm so loving this. So if you have, like, you love southern flavors, like fried corn and corn pudding, I've got a Mexican twist on it. Okay. So if you want to do a little whisking for me, I will come whisk. on. All right. So okay, if you want to add in your corn, and then if corn is out of season, you can add, you know, frozen corn in here. And then yes. I've got some melted butter and some other things. And Ooh. this is just, it's so easy. It comes together just in one bowl. All and in you one can bowl. Just, oh, yeah, all of our seasoning. Oh, what do you this. guys think of the cornmeal? Uh, yeah. It's delicious. Oh, okay, my you God. like the, the corn, corn pudding? The corn yes, pudding? Yes, the corn pudding. It's just Who so much you flavor. Like this? Okay, so I have a brand called Grand Baby Cakes, uh -huh. and it's because of my grandmother. She was my muse, my big mama. Oh, okay? you can big mama. I got a big mama. You can't go wrong with big mama. You can never go wrong with big mama. You know all the big mamas That's can cook. That's right. Okay, Every big mama can cook. All right. They can get down, Ooh. all right? 
So my big mama, she really inspired me in the kitchen. I grew up being in the kitchen with her, and she was the one who really taught me that love starts in your food. You well, put what all do we the do? love in it, and it tastes amazing. What do we do with this corn love? So once we get this in, we're gonna bake it off. This is your what beautiful it looks like. end right here. We're gonna add some cheese on top. We're gonna add mm. some tahini. We're gonna have some spices, and it's just <laughs> absolutely incredible. Okay, now what's this right here? Okay, well, okay. you gotta save the best for last, oh, and we got some dessert. All right, okay. dig in, dig into digging the corn. So you tell me what okay. this is. Wow. This is my peach bellini brunch. Oh, cake. damn! Wait, is it good? Is it popping? It's so good! It's oh, so God. good, right? Oh, yeah, so what's this fantastic piece right here? <laughs> okay, now you want to dig into them oxtails. I'm telling you, you yeah. over here. Okay, mm -hmm. get into that. Oh, damn! <laughs> oh, my God! When is these oxtails falling off the bone? I love I love it. That's my favorite. Yes, yes. So this... Oh, my gosh! <laughs> Y'all know y'all better get this book. Keep going. So this peach bellini cake is like, if you want dessert for breakfast, this is how you get down. It's got a wonderful peach syrup that's soaked into it with some champagne. Ooh. So if you love a bellini... Kate, how does the bellini taste? We're about to take it. Dig, dig in. in. Come on, y'all. I need some bellini. Oh, yeah, we're good. Too good. Get, off the good. get the bellini, Marco. No, no, oh, yeah. Oh, this is slamming. It's slamming. Come slamming. on, come mm -hmm. on. Oh. This corn dumpling and these oxtails, I can taste all of the flavor. All the flavor in it, and it is so good. I asked for sashimi for lunch. This all right? I got oxtail. <laughs> I don't want sashimi. Oh god. Oh man. Oh my god, <laughs> Chef Jocelyn, thank you so much for being here. Thank you. Studio audience, you are all going home with a copy of Jocelyn's book, Everyday Grand. And for more info on these recipes, go to SherryShowTV.com or just watch me eat. This is good. Yeah. <laughs>